Hello everyone, this is Max with A1 Website Pro and today I have a question come in. A client was wondering how you change the background on Linux Mint. So basically you'll just navigate to your files, your pictures, and you'll select the picture that you want to have the background. Here's one of my sons on their sled. And I'll right click it and notice here it says set as wallpaper. And when I set it as the wallpaper, there's the image of my sons. Now the other thing that you could do is go down to your Linux icon and then type in backgrounds and you'll see that backgrounds come up and you could see a list of all of the, the images that you've used for your backgrounds. For example, this is the last one I had on there. You'll notice my background changes to it. Uh, here's one of my sons and I you know, in the black and white. And you could just, just select one of the images that, that you want. Uh, now the other thing that you could do is you could go into settings here and instead of the picture aspect as being zoom you could say uh, you could have it as mosaic where it's repeating the image over and over again uh, another picture setting would be centered so that it's centered and with the centered you could actually change the the background uh, effect you can have it be like a gradient you could set this one to know, yellow and you set the other one to black so it's gradient from yellow to black okay um, let's see here there's also a scaled image you could scale the images you could stretch the images so it kind of looks kind of stretched out uh, the other thing that you could do is you could span the image okay kind of like looks like the image centered as well but uh, yeah, that's how you do it and uh, you could select the different uh, backgrounds that you want and, and like i said as, as a real quick type of a thing you could actually just go to an image um, and right click on it and select set as wallpaper and it happens just like that so this is max with a website pro i hope that you enjoyed this tutorial i will see you in the next one